They're attacking the dogs, I can hear them. Do you see, do you see this? If you look very closely. They're attacking my head now. I'm changing the shape of the desk. You know, because we're God and we can pretty much fucking do anything. You change the shape of the desk. Morph it. Kind of like Nia. When he uh, flies through the guy's body. Agent Smith. And then he flexes and the room amount around him bends. It's because everything that you see is your own consciousness. It is just you. You can't see it very well, but I can bend and morph and shape the desk. I mean, I can move stains in the floor. Um, I can move like pins and stuff. Let me try to move this again. Consciousness is hard to understand when you begin because it's not just the feeling of the force. You have to tell your mind that you're moving it. And it's really fucking hard to let go. A lot of people ask me, how do you let go? How do you do this? And you have to realize that you're in a dream and anything is possible. You, uh, just like in the uh, song, The Grudge. The flies are, the foot, planes are flying over my house. Just like in the song, The Grudge from Tool, uh, towards the end of the song, they say, let go. It's the only way you can get out of this fucking prison is to let go of the construct. As in, let go of what you know. You have to unlearn everything you've learned, just like Yoda says. Everything you see around you, everything you touch, taste, feel, is just electrical impulses interpreted by your brain, which is consciousness and everything is shaped with your own consciousness so when you move an object you're only moving yourself when you touch and feel it you're only feeling yourself you tell it to 